It's Saturday morning and we're in school. Depressing, isn't it? I'm here to take this test called the SAT. Well, I'd rather be at the beach working on my TAN. Let's be honest. Taking a test is not most students' idea of a good time. In fact, the more important the test, the more anxious you might become. Hopefully this quick video will give you some tips on how to keep your cool during a test and reduce your test anxiety. Nervous? A little nervousness before a test can be good. It motivates us to work hard and put forth our best effort on the examination. When we become too anxious though, that anxiety can undermine our confidence and interfere with our ability to solve problems. Here are some tips to lower your anxiety. All right, concentrate, Slater, concentrate. How can I concentrate? I'm starving. I only had four Twinkies and a box of Dane for breakfast. You can start to prepare by taking care of yourself first. So making sure you take care of not only what you put in your body, how you rest your body, and how you move your body. So before a test, you want to make sure that you have a nutritious meal and that you've gotten enough sleep. And if you are feeling some body tension, we might also encourage you to engage in some moderate physical activity. So taking a jog, doing some stretches, doing some yoga. So not only studying, but also being able to take care of your whole being. That means getting a full night's rest, engaging in some light physical activity, and eating a well-balanced breakfast before that test. Taking care of yourself first can greatly improve your odds of doing well on that examination and avoid those testing jitters. The next thing to do is to come prepared. The more prepared you feel, the less anxious you might be. Make sure to arrive early. If it's an SAT test, get there, find your seat so you're ready to go before everything begins. Make sure you bring pencils, pens, scratch paper, calculators, any materials you might need. By showing up on time and being prepared, you won't have to waste that extra valuable energy worrying about the small things, and you can really focus on the real goal, doing your best on the test. When the test starts, relax. During a test, you may feel yourself becoming tense or nervous. Whenever you feel that tension building, take a brief relaxation break using whatever method works best for you. So here are some ideas. First, you can take several deep breaths, exhaling slowly after each one. Visualize the tension draining from your body as you breathe out. Tense your muscles and hold for five seconds, then relax. Repeat this three times. And think of a peaceful, quiet setting, maybe like the beach, and imagine yourself calm and relaxed in that setting. Then, get back to work. I've been waiting for this test my whole life. I'm a really mean answering machine. Throughout the test, make sure you are engaging in positive self-talk. Get rid of those irrational, negative thoughts and think positive. Adopt an upbeat but realistic attitude, saying things like, I prepared carefully for this test. If I do my best, I'll do great. One more tip. If your friends are nervous about the test, try to avoid talking with them about it. You don't want their anxiety rubbing off on you. Here are some effective test-taking strategies for test day. Listen carefully to directions. Be sure to pay attention to the proctor when he or she is explaining what to do. It would stink to make a silly mistake because you didn't pay attention to directions. Perform a brain dump. This is basically creating your own personalized cheat sheet to help you during the test. When you start the test, Take a few minutes to write down any important information you think might come up, like formulas. You can reference this later on when you're taking the test. Preview the test. This just means flipping through to get an idea of how many sections there are, how long the passages are, and what questions you might have to answer. Multiple choice. Don't get sidetracked looking for patterns of answers. Just do your best. And when in doubt, just guess. It is in your best interest to guess on every item on certain tests, like the SAT. So, if you don't know the answer, or you're running out of time, just take your best guess and bubble in every item. Skip the difficult items until last. Sometimes, when going through a test, we spend a lot of time mulling over difficult items and then don't answer other items that we might know. Skip these difficult items, move on, and then come back at the end to answer them. And finally, 
If you have any time left over, check your answers. When you're all finished, go through the test and make sure you bubbled in every single item and answered every item. The important thing to remember is to do your best. Don't look around and see what other people are doing, what page they might be on or how quickly they're going or what they're doing. Worry about yourself and doing what you can do. Remember, excellence is not being the best, it is doing your best. You got this, Huskies. Good luck.